Hello everybody, I was asked to talk a little bit about different lights options and the cases and specifically about CCFL and LED lights and when to use which one and if it even makes sense to use CCFL because it's all the technology and things like this. So I would like to make a small video to give you my thoughts on this subject. While generally speaking, LED lights is a newer technology, it's used more often now than CCFL. There is still a situation when CCFL light can achieve a certain result that cannot be achieved with LED. But before we go and look and actually at my Venom build and I show why I use CCFL lights specifically in my particular situation, I would like to point you a couple differences between CCFL light and LED light. While the major difference and also advantage for LED lights is the fact that you do not require external power supply because CCFL light is essentially is a, a bulb that requires high frequency power adapter called inverter. So you need this part and this means that you actually have a two items that potentially can burn. The light can be either physically damaged, it's, a, it's actually real glass which can be if bent excessively it will just crack and you have a power supply and either one or other can burn so you have a two items that can burn for LED lights normally the time between failure is much higher for LED lights but what I'm observing recently is that there are more and more really cheap LEDs appearing on the market so if you see price really low uh, don't be fooled. There are no free cheese in this world. So you might get a light that will leave just a week and will die. And I'm pretty sure some of you already experienced with that. So the question of uh, quality, it's actually in the place. So when you shop for LED lights, be a little bit wary of the absolutely dirt cheap options because they might be, be a little bit disappointed later. But again, speaking about how convenient to use LED light or CCFL light, obviously LED light wins because you just plug it directly to your power source, you get whatever you need. CCFL, you have a little box, you need to hide it and tackle it somewhere and potentially it can burn as well. Okay, now as we covered power requirements and reliability issues a little bit, let's speak about CCFL and LED as a light emitting device and what's the differences between two. The major difference with CCFL and actually it's an advantage in certain situations that this is a round bulb that emits light in 360 degree direction. So it's create an ambient type of the light because the light goes everywhere, it bounces from all parts of the case, so it's more diffused. On the other hand, LED light is a bunch of uh, little torches, so to speak, you, because you have this LED light, which is electronic device, which is like funnel shaped piece of plastic with uh, this light on the bottom. And sometimes the funnel can be very narrow, like 30% angle, or sometimes really wide, 160% angle. But in the end of the day, this is a little mini torch that shine light in a certain direction. So you point your strip towards certain part and it will be light up really well in the middle it will be less light as you go on the other side so light doesn't will cover entire case also it will produce number of shadows so they create additional challenge so if you want more or less even light inside of the case you need to put strip on one side of the case on the other side bottom up so you try to even it out maybe you can dim them a little bit and achieve whatever you want but it might require a little bit more work than with cc felt it's just like shine everywhere and it's kind of more or less glows evenly now another thing that i like to point about the advantage of CCFL from my personal experience for UV light source specifically. It looks like that UV CCFLs produce a wider spectrum of UV light and make it works better as more universal type of the um, UV ignition device. So if you have LED strip which usually have pretty narrow um, wavelength property and you have a CCFL light, things usually glow a little bit stronger with CCFL type of the light than the UV. That's strictly from my experience. So if you have some parts that are really hard to make it glow, for example, green or blue glows perfectly with anything. 
red or orange, for example, or yellow to a certain degree, it's more difficult to make them glow. Dark yellow at least, not acid yellow. So with um, CCFL light, you can make your red tube glowing a little bit stronger and uh, then with the uh, LED light. So that's something to consider. I usually try to use a CCFL if I have UV reactive properties. And if I have a colored type of the light required inside the case, I would say CC, uh, LEDs would be much wiser choice. Okay, now let's look on my build. I will be using blue light, for example. I, I used to have a green, but uh, blue will be show a little bit stronger on the cam, so it's better for making example. All right, couple of words what I tried to achieve in this particular build. So I had a sandwich radiator between driver fans, which is transparent acrylic type of the fans. So what I tried to do, first of all, I wanted to create a glow on the radiator, you know, like some guys do neon lights under their car, so they're kind of floating on the road. So that's something that inspired me to do the same thing. So I tried to make sure that I have some sort of glow on the radiator fan assembly area, but also I wanted that the fans could be glow as well. So that's why I use CCFL light because it's put some light on the bottom of the case and it's also allow me to make fans glow and they, they don't work right now so you don't see it as well but when they're spinning you actually more lights is get um, reflected inside of the fans and they look much cooler on the other hand so if we switch from ccfl light to led light just for the similar situation you will see the difference how it looks now i have a led strip mounted under the radiator and fan assembly you can see how differently it looks. First of all light only goes down, it gets mostly absorbed by the bottom of the black bottom of the case so while the strip itself actually brighter than CCFL counterintuitively it's turned to be looks dimmer in the end of the result and obviously you have nothing uh, glowing in, on the lights, or, sorry, on, on the fans itself. So if I want the same result as I had with CCFL lights, I actually need second strip and mount it up. So one is one side will glow down, other side is glowing, glowing up, and then there probably will be similar result. Also, you can see that the width of the glow hollow under the entire assembly also is narrow. It's because the light it just goes a certain direction and it stops. So you have like a border where the light doesn't doesn't spread anymore while with the ccfl because it goes everywhere we have this uh, glowing like portion of the spot of the glowing spot was much wider than we had before so as you can see if you after certain effects it could be one or other if it doesn't matter obviously led is more advanced technology just because for example as you can see I can go to my fan controller and I can play with it so and depends what I want to do I can make it full or, or a little bit less and achieve certain results and um, it's especially important when you try to use it as a, as a spotlight so you want to highlight just enough for your liking so anyways that's the thing that I was asked to cover for a couple occasions and I hope for those of you who are interested in this kind of things which is just I think as important as making nice cables and other beautifications of your builds you find this uh, video interesting. In nutshell that's the difference between those two lights and how I use them differently in my personal build CCFL versus LED. I use Darkside brand to make this demonstration both products available either in states or Canada. In states you're welcome to grab those lights from frozen CPU and Canada as usual is does mode. They have a variety of colors, LED is sleeved, dimmable, whole nine yards, very nice product. So guys, if you'd like to hear about anything else that you confused or just want more details, put it in the comments. I will happy to make a video for you. It's always fun. See you soon.